How to bend a cantilever really fast. Welcome to another episode of my power webinars in lean orthodontics. My name is Dr. Martin Baxman. Today we are going to do some cantilever wire. So wire bending again. And what you need is a 1725 stainless steel wire. And this one here, that's a loop bending plier. And now get down to action. <laughs> The cantilever wire is such an important tool for you to know how to bend it because you use it for every canine and even for impacted fives and sometimes you can even use it for intrusion or extrusion arches. In this example we have a 1725 stainless steel wire again and we use a loop bending plier and as you can see we start with a double helix. At the end of the cantilever you use a U-band so you can attach something like a chain or a bracket or whatever you like to attach to it. Make sure that the bottom of the U and the double helix points into the same direction. Both have to point in the direction where the tooth is that you want to move. As you can see here, when you push the cantilever downwards, you need to compress the double helix. That's the way it works best. See how it works on the canine. And that's it. It's such a useful tool. Have fun bending it and using it every day. <laughs> <laughs> 